We're here, of course, at the Veterans Food Bank with Marie. Now, Marie, tell us what you need right now or what you would request most from people. Um, the biggest thing we really, really need right now is canned fruit and canned vegetables. Okay. Um, we could certainly use some crackers and cookies. Um, flour and sugar is another thing that we run out of constantly. We're pretty low on juice right now. Um, yeah, there's a few things, you know, whatever... Whatever you would probably eat at home would be nice to share with your veterans. Right, okay. And uh, what about when it comes to volunteerism? Are you still taking some volunteers and looking oh, for absolutely. people to help? We um, are pretty much booked for the next few weeks here in November, but I've only got one booking for the month of December. So if people want to come in and volunteer, they're more than welcome to give me a call and we can set it up. And what do those volunteer hours look like? What would they be doing? Um, the volunteer hours are from 8 in the morning till... Well, we, we can stay till up till 6 o'clock, okay. Monday through Friday, and then we're pretty much booked for Saturdays, but we still have some openings. Okay. And we, you know, we found that we kind of made our weekends family days so you can bring your children in as long as they're over 12 years old and the kids really seem to like that. Okay. Or if they're off for Christmas or school breaks, we'd, we'd be happy to have them come in. Awesome. And what are they spending their time doing while they're here? Oh, they'll be building hampers or sorting some of this food or pa repackaging things. Like we'll repackage sugar, flour. We will be getting in a lot of Halloween candy, so we make up little candy bags for our veterans. Okay. Um, and there's the sorting of the food. Everything has to be date checked or whatever, so... Okay. Perfect. Me, there's lots to do. There's always lots to do. Marie, if people want more information or they want to get a hold of you and find out how they can help, what's the best way to do that? Um, they can just contact the Calgary Poppy Office or they can contact the Canadian Legacy Project. Okay, perfect. We're back with more from here at the Veterans Food Bank or the Poppy Fund right after the break. Stay with us.